back here at Angel Stadium. Welcome in John Shambi and Chris Singleton. We've got one out here in inning number seven. 50% luck, 50% going out. Brandon Drury to the plate. The first baseman, Brandon Drury. And there's the strike. As a pitcher, you know the runner on second is ready to push things with his speed. A base hit's probably going to be a big run, so you really have to execute on the mound. One out. The go-ahead run is at second. Next pitch inside. One and one. And a big swing and a miss. And it really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider, but they've not been able to commit to one velocity and stay there. Next one just misses. And the count is two and two. Next offering is fouled back. That one to first. Tosses to the pitcher covering the bag. Two away. Well, there's a lot riding on that at bat right there. Nice no job of the Number pitcher two. to bear down, make Second the pitch, get man. the ground ball. Excellent piece of work. Luis Renjifo gets a chance to hit here. The switch hitter batting right. Matt Theis comes up to hit here. One for two. Here's a rip to short, but he's there for the third out. Angels strand a couple, and we are still scoreless. Back in Anaheim, and now the center fielder, Harrison Bader. Swings and misses. Strike one. Anderson into his eighth inning of work singing he's been good yeah he's the type of guy that gets better as he gets deeper into the ball game if you're going to get to him you get to him early they didn't do that today we'll see what happens as this finishes good piece of hitting right there nice hard line drive to the outfield you're trying to get on base represent that go ahead run can't hang your head on that at all and first offering is fouled off Next pitch is popped up. Drury settles under it. Puts the squeeze on that one. Two down. So digging in, Oswald Peraza. Swings through that one. 0 oh and 1. Trying to keep good speed off the bases. Liner, base hit. Joey gets on base and keeps it going. Dominant performance for him today, Boo. Just two hits allowed so far, no runs across either, and he's had an answer for just about every hitter he's faced, so I don't think this hit is going to knock him off his stride too much. Here's Jose Trevino. Now snap throw to first, and he's back in easily. And the first pitch misses for ball one. That one missed. Chris with that distraction and the speedy guy at first, he's in a favorable hitter's count. Well, if nothing else, I mean, this is a great spot for a hitter to be in. That's a strike and a count two and one. Foul ball there. Anderson ready to work. Battling here as he fouls it away. Step off, throw to first. And he's back in safely. Two two on the way. And there's a the ball. 3-2, two, two out, runner on first. A lot of movement in the infield. Hitter's got to stay focused on the pitch. Next offering is foul back.
three two and he walked him so close to getting out of it right there but this inning still has life the second baseman labor four Back to the top of the Yankee order. Here comes Glaber Torres. First offering misses badly for ball one. Well, this is a critical spot for both the pitcher and the hitter. You can learn a lot about a guy by how he handles these pressure situations. Up the middle, diving, and he can't make the play. Run comes in from second, and it's 1-0. Well, they strike first as he gets the job done to bring home the run. Once you get the ball by the pitcher, there's a lot of base hits up the middle, even on ground balls. So a nice job to use that big hole and get himself a hit. So first and second with two outs. And up next for New York, Aaron Judge. On the ground to the left, Fletcher. They take the force out. Inning ends, and that stops the bleeding. But they pick up one run on the RBI single. It's now 1-0. It's Major League Baseball, and it's on the show. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And now the catcher comes up to hit. Logan Ohapi. First offering misses the mark. Well, certainly doing his very best out there on the mound to bring that win streak to a halt. Rodon ready. Here comes. Oh. There's a strike. And misses inside. Now in this three ball count, down in the ball game, you've got to be very selective. Take your walk if they'll give it to you. Ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. Always feels amazing getting a job oh, done when the team needs you to come through. It's just bigger than your own individual stats. Just kept it simple. Played Pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from. And there's just no one there to knock it down. And the first pitch misses for ball one. With a single base runner because of all the power, they are dangerous. This is smacked. Left field line. That one is gone. That should fire up the dugout, and they lead it. It's 2-1. so tough to come in as a pinch hitter and have success. I mean, you really have to keep yourself locked into the game and ready at any time. So it's always impressive to me when someone jumps in there and hits it out. It's a huge lift for your ball club as well. Darren Boone makes his way out of the dugout, and he will make a move to the bullpen. Carlos Rodon is done in this one, and a nice effort out of him, no doubt. New arm coming on. We'll be back for that in a moment. Michael King taking over on the mound. And he's been fantastic this year, really stingy in terms of allowing base runners. He's just got great stuff that's tough to square up. Fletcher in the box now, no balls and a strike. In for a strike, 0-2 oh, down. With the big bats coming up and a home run already surrendered, he's really going to have to execute against these next couple of batters. Got him looking, that's a strikeout. Well, that event seemed to be over as soon as it started. Three-pitch strikeout. You've got to be better at the plate right there, at least to foul something off, extend that at bat. Ward stands in now and watches strike one. That's in there, and it's nothing in two. 
Well, he's gotten ahead with two pitches down in the zone. He has plenty of options right here. He can go up, he can go away, he can add velocity, he can subtract. One down, base is empty. The punch out there, two out. Boog, he was shopping at the buckle right there, the way that slider made him walk. That was just nasty. Two outs, base is empty. And now Shohei Otani. And that one is lifted in the air. Hicks makes his way towards it. He can't get there. That should be extra bases. In safely with a double, his second of the day. He has had such a good day today. I don't think he's going to want to leave when it's over. A couple of doubles today for the DH. Hunter Renfro at the plate. Foul ball. The 0 1. Up the middle. Peraza fires over to first. And that is the inning. Two run shot for the Angels this inning. Last chance coming up here for the Yankees. You're Staying in the game on defense, Mike Trout. He'll be out center now after pinch hitting. A new arm into the game, the righty, Jimmy Hergit. He's having a ton of success facing left-handed hitters this season, so this seems like a smart move to turn to him with a lefty at the plate. Oh, and one now. In the air, right field. That's back. Pulls it in on the warning track. Man, I love that route. The ball was smoked. He knew he had to get back to the track right away. Turned his back. On the infield, got to the spot, turned around, and made a nice catch. Well, they've kept him pretty quiet in this series. Still doesn't have a knock. I know you want to get that first knock out of the way. Maybe more will come. But you got to give some credit to the pitching staff. They've had a great plan against him. Here comes a pitch. Way high there. And now it's even one and one. Swing and a miss. He was late. Strike two. And time called at the plate. Maybe trying to slow things down here in a crucial spot. The pitch. And just misses with that one. Home plate umpires trying to tighten things up a little bit. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. Man, I really like the ability to bounce back right there after not getting the call. He probably should have gotten He didn't let it affect his focus, and he came back with another good pitch to get him swinging. So they're down to their final out. Here's Josh Donaldson. That misses the zone, and that's ball one. Herget, 29 years old, and he was a sixth-round draft pick back in 2015 and that's through there for a strike you now this manager knows that his players are just trying to do too much everybody needs to just take a deep breath relax and let it naturally happen and a pitch and another ball Just missed. Big pitch coming right here. Last thing he wants to do is put the tying run on base, but he can't groove one either. Strike two. Just a really nice slider down and in there. He wants to get the hitter thinking fastball, speed him up, and just subtract some velocity and add a little movement. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Didn't miss by much right there. Just couldn't get the call off now the inside corner. The center fielder, Harrison Bader. Substitution now at first base. Coming in as the pinch runner, Isaiah Kiner Falefa. And now Bader up to the plate. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Right now, they're looking for something hit hard into the gaps, give them an opportunity with two outs to score that run from first. 
And the righty deals. That one catches the zone, and it's a ball and a strike. And now the count, one and two after the swing and the miss. Got him! And that's the ball game. 